Hi, this is Jody from Jody Meneer Photography. I'm going to show you today how to make a digital package in Pixie Set. First thing you do is open your dashboard and then you're going to go to your store. You're going to go to products and then we are going to make a new price sheet. So you go to add price sheet and you're going to choose, uh, we'll choose uh, Lab Fulfill and give your price sheet a name. We'll name this price sheet um, Sample Price Sheet. Okay, select your lab, we'll pick White House, and then we want to make sure Add Common Products is there. Hit Save. So this um, is just a sample of White House's general price sheet. Okay, all the prices are filled in for you. If you want to change the prices, you can. Just hit the little pencil, pops up a window, change this price right here, um, and that's all you need to do. You can even um, hit the trash can and take out. If you don't want to sell an 8x12 print, take it out. But let's see, how do we create a digital package? So we have a client who um, may have purchased a session and it maybe the session came with um, five images, digital images, or maybe it didn't come with any digital images and we want them to be able to purchase um, a certain amount of digital images. So the first thing we need to do is realize that in this uh, demo package here, our starter package, there is no section that says digital yet. We just have prints, canvases, mounted prints, and metal prints. Okay, so we need to go set up the digital section. We're going to go up to the top and hit add product. We're going to go to digital download and we're going to choose single photo pick which size photo you want them to download. You can learn more about them by clicking the learn more. I'm going to keep mine original for now and then I'm going to keep single photo download original um, as my product name and I'm going to give it a price. Let's say my digitals are $100. You can add a description but for a digital image it's pretty self-sufficient so we'll hit add. Now when we have our main um, price sheet, we can scroll down and know that there is a digital section. Okay, so you want to add a package. So you go to add products, you go to print digital package, and you're going to give it a name. So let's name this one 15 digital image package. And we could put a description and let's give a price. So at $100 a piece, this package should be $1,500. Let's sell it for $1,400 to give our customers um, a, um, an incentive to purchase this package because they get it for less. And then we got to go down to this next section and we scroll through until we find the digital category, which is right here. So a single photo download, we need to go to the plus and we need to click it 15 times so that we can see um, that we're adding 15 separate images to this package and hit the add button. Okay, so now let's go see how our package is looking. Um, if you look up in the packages area, here's where our new package is. We open it up and we see we have 15 single photo downloads. All right, so let's say that you're, um, you're, you've got 30 images in here. So your client's going to get to pick which 15 of those 30 that they're going to want. So let's just go to um, a, um, a collection right now and pick a collection. This one doesn't have 15 photos in it, but that's okay uh, for, for this example. We're going to go to the little sprocket right here underneath the picture. And we're going to make sure that the download is set to off. If this is set to on, your client can download your pictures, the whole gallery, and not pay you through your shopping cart. So unless you've collected that fee up front, let's have that turned off. Then we'll go to the store, make sure it's turned on, and click on the word store. Once we're in here, we're going to go to our price sheet, and we're going to pick the one we just made called Sample Price Sheet. 
make sure our store status is on, and then go down and view our um, gallery. So we'll come in here and take a peek at our gallery. Let's say our client wants to order this photo um, or to order a package, they can click on this shopping cart right here and right here at the top, 15 digital image package. Okay, so they can add that to their cart and they're going to get this screen that's going to ask them to add 15 different images. They'll hit the plus sign, they'll choose the image they want to add and hit select and they'll do that for every single image that they want to add to their collection. Okay, so once they have that done, they can hit done and it takes them to their shopping cart. Now you'll notice that my shopping cart says I've only chosen three of the 15 and so since I have not picked all 15, I'm going to get this message that says all packages must be completed in order to check out. So it's going to let, tell my client they need to go back and do some more shopping and pick out some more images. So that's how um, adding a digital package works. I hope that you found that helpful. One thing that a lot of people do um, that makes it helpful is at the beginning of the um, collection here, they'll actually add a PDF file as their first file that tells their client, you know, maybe um, a price list or maybe instructions on how to download a digital photo or um, instructions on how to add a um, package to their um, to their shopping cart. So anyway, hope that helped you and I hope you have a great day.